Hola mundo! We are Nina and Marcus, a Swiss couple showing you everything about our beautiful country, Switzerland. In our last three videos, which you shouldn't miss, we took you along with us on our journey to buy a house in Switzerland. In this episode, we will give you an update about the house buying situation and we will take you on a winter hike. So, relax, enjoy and if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Wow, that were really some interesting past weeks uh, with our project of buying the house in Ticino in Switzerland. As I told you in the last video, which I will link up here, um, we had decided on a house we wanted to buy. It was in Intragna, that is in the north part of Ticino. And it was a beautiful house. It had one disadvantage, it was a bit dark, but it was this rustico style old stone house. So we were happy with it. And our plan was to renovate it in March and April and to rent it out latest for the 1st of May, which is a holiday. So a lot of Swiss people uh, will do a long weekend break and we wanted to rent it at that time. Well, obviously we are still at home and not in Ticino renovating the house. Um, the process with the notary stopped after we got the okay from the bank for the mortgage. Um, the notary first didn't start working. It was a very unprofessional procedure and we were a bit, well, all the alarm clocks were, were on, so um, we knew something is a bit strange. We were waiting for four and a half weeks, nothing had happened. We had asked several times, we gave them a deadline, uh, nothing happened. Uh, it was like, uh, this one is, it's this one's fault, it's that one's fault and, um, well, nothing moved on. So we finally went to Ticino once again and found a new house, which we completely fell in love with. It is in a region we never thought we would go there, but uh, it turned out that it's beautiful. It's in nature. We are surrounded by lush forests. Uh, it's in a hiking area. It's near the city Lugano. That means in the south of Ticino. So uh, something completely new. And the agency was very professional, very organized, very quiet. The house owner who's still living there said, wow, I like you, I want to sell you the house. So we continued with this project and with the other we just waited. And now yesterday evening there came the okay from the bank that they will help us financing this second house. And so it was for us, it was a quick decision because we were so happy with that house. We canceled the house in Entrania and we'll proceed now with a new house. Today we talked to the agency, they will prepare everything, the notary is already involved and this time I didn't have to pay a reservation fee of 10,000 Swiss francs, this time it was just my okay and everything was fine, they immediately um, cancelled all the sales activities on the internet and I could see this, so this is a really reliable situation. The bank is fine with it, uh, the owner wants to sell us this and I have the name and phone number of the notary and things start moving now. Unfortunately so far we couldn't film because the owner is still living in there and it's an old lady so I didn't want to disturb her with filming but um, we will show you the house as soon as possible and hopefully next week we can come up with more information and more pictures and videos. For now, um, we can lean back a little bit, problem solved, and we decided to go on an amazing winter hike, which we can highly suggest in our region here at home. We drove to Interlaken, which is 20 minutes away from our home and we went on a winter hike. Let's go! You see the house up here? This is the harder cool where we will climb. 
Now we are at the foot of the Harder Kulm and there are different trails going up. We take the Harder Run, which is also supposed to be a, a trail where people run up. We will just walk very normally. <laughs> and yeah, let's go. And of course you can also go up the hill uh, the lazy way with the train. But today the train is closed. It doesn't work in winter at some time, so no chance, we have to walk. There are really people running up the hill. This is how we look like when we go up. See wonderful Lake Brienz. Here in the distance we have Lake Thun. Beautiful place. You see the Jungfrau uh, Mönch, eigentlich you can't see, but the Jungfrau Joch on the top, there on the ridge. We made it! Yes! And look at the views! On this side you have Lake Thun And on the other side, you have Lake Brienz. And just behind me, you see Eiger, Mönch and Jungfrau. I call this an amazing view. <laughs> If you want to experience the viewing platform in peace and alone, come here in winter. In summer this platform is packed with people, you can hardly get a place to take your picture. 
and now we are alone on the platform amazing if you like this video subscribe to our channel give us a like and see you in the next one hola mundo